Yo, it's me, Dead Carpet, and it's 9.50 a.m., and it's Saturday, September 3rd, 2022. Anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing another flavor of these Warhead sodas. Got this at my local Quick Trip. Um, I got, well, they had five different flavors, but I got all five they had. In total, was like um, $8.87 with tax, so about $8. So it's probably about a dollar, maybe $30 to a dollar, 40-something in cans, so I guess, okay priced. But um, anyway, this one sounds like it might be pretty good. We shall see. Anyway, today I'm going to be reviewing the new Sour Black Cherry Warhead Soda. So, oh yeah, boys, look at that can. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah. It has a silver top with a silver tab. The bottom's Best Buy Date and Production Code. Best Buy June 9th, 2024. So it's still fresh for a while. Has like a splattered paint sort of design. Looks pretty cool. It shows the cherries and stuff. Um, so yeah. Warheads, sour black cherry soda, 12 fluid ounces, 355 milliliters, naturally flavored. Contains 0% juice, nutrition facts, sodium says 1 can, 355 milliliters, amount per serving calories 150, total fat 0 grams, 0% sodium 10 milligrams, 0%, total carbohydrates 36 grams, 13%, total sugars 35 grams, includes 35 grams added sugar, 70%, protein 0 grams, drinkwarheads.com, info drinkwarheads.com. My flavor packed sour soda will blow your mind and taste buds away, Wally, and has a QR code, probably takes you to their website. That has SKU, some other codes in the ball logo, 12 foot ounces, and the other ingredients. Carbonated water, sugar, malic acid, natural flavor preservatives, potassium sorbate, sodium benzoate, and red 40. Manufactured in partnership with Warheads for Firebrands, LLC, Miami Beach, Florida. 33139 Warheads is a registered trademark of Impact Confections Incorporated. So yeah, that's pretty much the entire can. Not a lot of stuff on it, so I'll let you see the can right quick. And I'll show off the can up close though in a minute. Head's exploding because it's like really soury now. Um, his lips are puckered. Okay, nutrition facts. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's a little bit reflective, so I'm sorry about that. And the SKU. Okay, and the other ingredients. Like the other code, I mean, you can't really see it. I might be able to see it a little bit. Okay, the other ingredients. The distributor information. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can, so now I'm going to shove the can up close right quick, so hold on a minute. The Black Cherry Warhead Soda. has the same splattered paint design like the other flavors. Best by date's hard to see. Shows the cherries. Okay, nutrition facts. QR code, the SKU and the other codes. Yeah, it stopped recording, but yeah, the ball logo and the other stuff, the other ingredients, and the distributor information. Okay, that's pretty much the entire can. So now I'm gonna finish my review for it, so hold on a minute. Okay, I shut off the can up close, and so I'm gonna shake it up a little bit, open it, taste it, and get my review for it, so hold on a minute. I'm gonna try not to spill it on the white shirt. Okay, the color is a dark blood red. Almost like a darker hot pink. It might have a little bit of like pink in it. Um, see what I mean? But yeah, it's like a dark red. Definitely a very strong dark red. Definitely blood red. Definitely bubbly and carbonated. So yeah. Anyway, the scent, 
Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Definitely smells like it's going to be better than the watermelon one. And maybe the lemon one too. We shall see though. But, um, the smell. Definitely like, um, cherry. But, um, reminds me a little bit of the, um, the cherry cheesecake. Yo Play Whips Yogurt. Um, if you had that, um, it smells like what that tastes like. Like, sort of like a creamy cherry. You know, this is supposed to be black cherry. Um, it's like a yogurty, like, sort of cherry smell. Um, yep, just like cherry yogurt. Um, doesn't really smell like black cherry to me. Um, just smells like wild cherry. Um, but yeah, definitely smells, definitely cherry though, that's for sure. Um, but yeah, it actually smells pretty good, so we shall see how it tastes, so here goes. Oh yeah, boys. Oh yeah. Yep, this is the best one of the ones that are reviewed so far. Really good cherry flavor. Definitely a little tart, definitely a little sour, but not too sour. It's not as sour as like the watermelon one or the lemon one. Maybe about the same as the green apple. Well, that sip is definitely more sour than the first couple sips. But yeah, I do get the puckeriness on my lips a little bit, and also on my tongue a little bit. It has a little bit of like a um, fizzy sensation when you're drinking it, like on your tongue. Not like normal fizz, and you know when it goes down your throat and stuff, but um, I think it's like a sour sort of fizz. It's like a puckeriness in your mouth and your tongue. Sort of like Pop Rocks, but um, maybe like 10% of that strength, you know? So it has like a little bit of like a sort of like a tingling sensation. Um, but yeah, it's definitely really good, definitely flavorful. Definitely a strong but pungent, sweet and tart cherry flavor. Maybe a little bitter, but um Yep, definitely sour cherry. Definitely it says sour black cherry, but to me it's just like sour normal cherry. See what I mean? Um but yeah, it tastes really good though. Has a really cool can design, it's okay price, like around a dollar forty something a can. Yeah, I got it at Quick Trip. It's brand new. Definitely try it if you can find it. Um, very interesting soda. Um, yeah, that's my favorite one of these Warhead sodas. Um, then I like the um, I think the green apple one, then the lemon one, then the watermelon one. Yeah, the watermelon I thought I'd like best because I like the Warhead's Ghost Energy Drink, but I liked it the least. So you know that's weird. Interesting. Um, but yeah, definitely try this one. Really good. Definitely highly recommend it. I'd probably give the Sour Black Cherry Warhead Soda a 10 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. Oh yeah, really, definitely try it. It tastes good. Yeah, it's definitely a little sour, but not too sour. So, yeah, definitely try it. I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. So, oh yeah, boys, it's lit. So, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm going to give it a 10 out of 10. Oh yeah. And well, my next review is going to be the last one of these Warhead Sodas. It's the Blue Raspberry one. Stay tuned for that review. So, my current review, Star Wars videos. So, watching. See you guys later. Peace out. And bye.